This video is presented by Big Pete Steakhouse, a proud supporter of the Caledonia Corvairs. Big Pete's features a sleek design, delicious cocktails, and an elevated yet comfortable dining experience. Check out the menu at bigpete's.ca and book a reservation by calling 905-765-4340, extension 4206. The Caledonia Corvairs revved up, returning to the ice for their first game of the playoffs. The Corvairs coming off a first round bye, facing the Hamilton Kilty Bees in the Golden Horseshoe semifinals. The best of seven series starting on Friday night, and it's Hamilton with the first good scoring chance. The puck is flipped ahead. Anthony Giacalone is stopped by Keegan Jackson. Good save there from the Corvairs netminder. A few minutes later, it's a Caledonia power play. They set it up for Marcus Dempelwolf, and he rips in the first goal of the night. Wolf giving his team a 1-0 lead after 20 minutes. Second period now, here comes Hamilton. Chris Reed puts it on a tee for Anthony Giacalone and he ties the game. That's his fifth marker of the playoffs. We are knotted at one and the Bees keep coming. Two minutes later, the puck bounces to Ryan Scriven in front and he scores. Hamilton has their first lead of the night. It's 2-1 Kilty Bees, but the Corvairs answer before the period is over. Here is Nathan Duplessis is over to Marcus Wolf. He fires and scores. Wolf with his second marker of the night. It's 2-2. Then we've got a big collision behind the net. Jaden Lamel and Dean Della Georges both ending up on the ice. The game is tied 2-2 after two periods. Back to the highlights in a minute. First, a reminder, this video is presented by Big Pete Steakhouse, a proud supporter of the Corvairs. Check out the menu and book a reservation at bigpeets.ca. Third period, now the Corvairs with an odd man rush. The rebound pops out to Stephen Laform, and he buries it. Caledonia's back on top. They take a 3-2 lead. A few minutes later, it's more from Laform. He's on the near side, and he scores on the power play. The Corvairs looking good with a two-goal lead, but this game not done yet. Back comes Hamilton. Owen King finding space in front. He spins and scores. The Kilty Bees are right back in it with four minutes left in regulation. And the Bees looking to tie it up. It's a good opportunity for Gianmarco Karingi. Big stop from Keegan Jackson. He keeps it a one goal game. That it's a partial break for Anthony Giacalone. Jackson once again shuts the door. He made 27 saves in the game and it's a Corvair's victory. They take game one by a final score of 4-3. Here is Keegan Jackson talking about those two big stops in the final minutes of regulation. It's just another shot. Uh, it's all I'm here to do is stop pucks and uh, keep the boys in the game. It's good to get the first one going. Uh, boys are obviously a little bit anxious to get going. Uh, it's a long time to sit. Uh, overall, we're just happy to get the win. We don't care how we do it. We just uh, want to keep going here. 